Hi everyone. One question we might have if you're taking my class is, how do you write one of these crazy outlines? I know a lot of you uh, have concerns about that when you're putting together your arguments, so I wanted to give you a quick, very quick video demonstration of how to do that. First of all, you need your issue question. You can't do anything until you've got your question. For example, uh, should gay marriage be legalized in the United States? Is abortion moral? Any question like that that you can answer with a straightforward response, with a straightforward sentence. You're going to have three lines in your outline. And by three lines, I mean three sentences and nothing more than three sentences. The last sentence should actually be the one that you write first. Write that immediately after your issue question. Why? Because you want the reader to know immediately, and you want to know immediately, what it is that you're arguing in this paper. So, Let's say that your question is about gay marriage. Should GM be legalized? Conclusion, let's say yes, just for the sake of argument. If your answer is yes, then the rest of what you want to do is put together your modus ponens argument structure. Remember that that goes if A, then B in the first line then A in the second line. B is repeated here. Right? So, that's your modus ponens structure. You've got your issue question. Now you've got your response, your conclusion. Now you know already what B is, because you've already written it. B is, gay marriage should be legalized. So now your job is to come up with a reason to legalize gay marriage. And that's your A. So, A would be something like, if everybody should have the right to be married according to their sexual preference, then gay marriage should be legalized. Or, if any two people who are in love should be allowed to get married, then gay marriage should be legalized, etc., etc. You see the point, right? So, recap, very quickly. Issue question. Conclusion first. If you write the conclusion first, you'll be better off, trust me. Then, premise one, line one, premise two, line two, and... You're all done. Thank you very much.